Well, it's been decades of ongoing tension and conflict involving the Cayuga Indian Nation in Seneca and Cayuga counties. At 2 in the morning Saturday, several buildings were destroyed on Cayuga Nation property. It was unclear who was the representative for the nation, but it was later confirmed that Clint Halftown was. According to Halftown, the buildings were demolished for public safety reasons. Now, the Seneca County Board of Supervisors is stepping in people voicing their concerns at a meeting held by the board yesterday. We are here to communicate that we are still here. You can destroy a store, you can destroy a schoolhouse, you can destroy a daycare, but you will never destroy us. Well, after that public comment period, the Seneca County Board of Supervisors came up with three resolutions. Freeze all federal funds to the Cayuga Indian Nation until the nation's leadership complies with local laws. Request for deployment of federal marshals in place of the Cayuga Indian Nation law enforcement to prevent further violence. And finally, they're calling on the U.S. Attorney for the Western District of New York to investigate and take action against recent decisions made by the Cayuga Nation.